treasuries carry hardly any risk. So whenever the economic outlook is bad, investors flock to the relative safety of treasuries. When it looks like a recession is in the near future, large financial institutions drop their riskier bets and buy up treasuries to keep at least some return coming through the door. When demand for treasuries goes up, the price of treasuries gets bid up and the yield goes down. So a worsening economic outlook leads to lower treasury yields and hence lower mortgage rates with one huge caveat, and that's the Fed rate. This graph shows us the 10-year treasury yield in blue and the effective Fed rate in green since 1990. From this graph, we can learn a couple of important things. The 10-year treasury yield isn't as dynamic as the Fed rate, but hikes in the Fed rate tend to push up the treasury yield and drops in the Fed rate tend to pull the treasury yield down. Secondly, the 10-year treasury yield usually, but not always, floats above the Fed rate. When the treasury yield drops below the Fed rate, it's always after a period of rapid Fed rate increases and around the time that the increases are leveling off. We should note that we're in that moment right now. 